In this demo, I'm going to show how you can maximize the value of Operations Bridge within your current environment. As today's hybrid IT environments become increasingly more complex, they become more difficult to monitor and troubleshoot effectively. This can lead to increased downtime of business services, loss of revenue, and customer dissatisfaction. Operations Bridge is designed to help organizations respond to these challenges in a variety of ways. First of all, our integration hub makes it easy to integrate OpsBridge with the existing tools and solutions in your environment. Operations Bridge can integrate data from over 200 different domain areas. Next, Operations Bridge provides end-to-end -end visibility of your entire hybrid IT estate and consolidates events, metrics, and topology from its own monitoring sources as well as from existing third-party domain tools. Operations Bridge leverages artificial intelligence and machine learning to reduce event noise by over 90% through automatic event correlation. This helps you identify the root cause of problems faster and improve application uptime. With its built-in automation capabilities, OpsBridge can create a closed-loop incident process with existing ITSM tools, reducing human error and improving mean time to repair. Finally, OpsBridge provides automated remediation actions to fix problems quickly. With OpsBridge acting as the central manager of managers, you can leverage these capabilities to speed up root cause analysis, lower mean time to repair, and fix problems before users are affected by them. Operations Bridge offers a full choice of deployment options to meet your organization's needs. It can be deployed in your traditional on-prem data center, cloud natively on a public cloud platform, and it is also offered as a SaaS solution for faster time to value. So let's take a look at how these capabilities can deliver value into your existing environment. In our demo, we're going to look at a fictional company called Advantage Online Shopping. As you can see from the topology mapping on the right, Advantage Online Shopping uses various infrastructure to run their internal and external company services. To start with, we're going to show how quick and easy it is to integrate a third-party solution into Operations Bridge by logging into our integration hub. Our integration hub provides a guided wizard interface that lets you quickly integrate different data sources into Operations Bridge. In addition, you're able to configure predefined options for each integration. To start, we'll go to our connected systems to see a list of available connectors. In this case, we're going to select the Dynatrace connector. Next, we provide the URL of our Dynatrace server and our authentication token to that server. Now we test the connection to validate that communication is working properly. Next, we select the route by which we want to integrate these data into Operations Bridge. In this case, we are using Operations Agent. Next, we'll go to the Configurator menu to configure our integration. Here, we select a template from the available list of templates. These templates are tuned to specific use cases, so choose the template that best suits your needs. In this case, we're going to select the Events and Topology template to get started. As you can see, these templates can be modified if necessary, but for now, we'll be using them as they are out of the box. Going to the dashboard, you can see that with a few simple steps, we've been able to integrate Dynatrace into the OpsBridge environment. Dynatrace events will now flow into OpsBridge Manager, where we can then link those events to key business services, as well as correlate any application health events from Dynatrace with the infrastructure events that are already available in Operations Bridge. Now let's take a look at how the Dynatrace integration helps us see the overall business service impact of the entire IT infrastructure, rather than just seeing the status of the individual components. Without the integration into Operations Bridge, it's nearly impossible to understand how a failure in one component of the infrastructure is impacting other areas, leading to unnecessary downtime and costly war room meetings. For their customer-facing shopping application, Advantage Online Shopping has built a business value dashboard that shows the health status of their business services and infrastructure. As you can see from the dashboard, there is a problem with one of the business services. Clicking on the status link takes you directly to the operator console of Operations Bridge, where you have an end-to-end -end view of the health of various components. In this example, the operator has a view that combines active events with the service topology and a status dashboard. 
we can see the topology of the business service laid out in the topology view, including topology that is synchronized from Dynatrace. The overall top-level service shows the impact inherited from its underlying components. In our example, we have a failure in the environment which has caused applications failures. Without this topology view, operators would have to chase down each event without understanding how it impacts the overall business service. As we can see in this scenario, we have a lot of events in the event browser in the lower left. Whether all of these are important or relevant to solving the problem at hand is questionable. They all have independent severities, and without operations bridge, they would likely lead to a lot of work items for the networking or server team to chase down. However, operations bridge uses the integrated service topology and automatically added impact relationships to correlate related events. Leveraging these relationships, OpsBridge creates a single group of auto-correlated events that represent the problem in the application. This dramatically reduces the number of events that need to be looked into by operators and reduces the time it takes to identify root cause. In our example, we have application infrastructure, in this case a Tomcat server, reporting a high CPU load. Diving into the correlated event details, we can take a look at related events. Here we can see that Dynatrace has reported a performance problem. Diving into that event, we can see that transactions are taking longer than anticipated, while a related network event shows a high utilization on a single interface. We also see a network configuration time that happened only a while ago. Taking a look at these correlated events, we can see that they belong together as they represent the same application. So we can take a custom action to promote this group of events since it makes sense. This optional step allows you to fine tune the machine learning algorithm and make it work more effectively within your environment. Operations Bridge can tightly integrate with ITSM tools to turn an event or problem into a ticket. The problem can then be updated in either OpsBridge Manager or in the ticketing system. In addition, the topology model that we saw earlier can be synchronized with the ITSM tool so that tickets and events can be reported against the same business services. This automated process greatly reduces the overhead needed to integrate single data sources into your ticketing tool. To illustrate this integration, we'll once again dive into our correlated events. From there, we can see that this event has been forwarded to our MicroFocus SMAC server. From this page, we can click on the link and are directly out routed to the specific ticket we had opened in Operations Bridge. Viewing the discussions, we can see the same events are recorded in SMACs that were recorded in Operations Bridge. Now that we have full visibility into all the elements of the problem, we can quickly identify the probable root cause and assign the ticket to a network operator. In this case, the network interface change predates all other events in the flow and represents the only change that is seen. The network operator determines that reversing the change will solve the problem, so they record the solution into the de ticket details within SMACs. Now it's time to actually resolve our problem. To reduce human interaction and optimize problem resolution, Operations Bridge leverages runbooks from our operations orchestration solution. This lets you tap into a library of pre-built automation workflows, as well as allowing you to build your own workflows. Using these automated workflows will reduce the time your operators spend on resolving problems and lower your mean time to repair. In our example, we dive back into our group of correlated events and select the ACL configuration runbook to revert the network change that caused our problems. We can see the runbook flow pop up and that it has successfully resolved the issue. Going back to our OpsBridge Manager console, we see the events clear up and the topology mapping turns green now that the issue has been resolved. Taking a quick look at our ROI dashboard, we can see that over the past five months or so, Operations Bridge has reduced the total number of events by more than 98%. When you leverage Operations Bridge as the core of your monitoring ecosystem, you benefit from a single manager of managers that integrates cross-domain data from existing tools and solutions in as little as three easy steps. Further, 
OpsBridge uses artificial intelligence and machine learning to automatically reduce event noise by over 90% and helps lead your team to the root cause using trainable algorithms, further lowering your mean time to repair. Finally, you can act quickly and confidently using consistent automation to remediate issues and return services to their optimum state. To find out more, please visit us at microfocus.com opsbridge. Thank <laughs> you.